Okay, in this video we're going to talk about vector addition and scalar multiplication. And all it really says is if you have two vectors, if you want to add or subtract them, you, you either add or subtract their corresponding components. It says if you multiply a vector by a real number, it says you just multiply each component by that real number. So nothing worse than that. Let's look at uh, a couple examples here. So here we've got uh, three vectors. V has components 0, 2. U has components negative 1, 4. W has components 5, comma, negative 3. And we want to find the components of a couple different vectors. So let's do part A here first. We'll do vector uh, W minus vector U. Well, the components for vector W, we said that was 5, comma, negative 3. And then we're going to subtract away the components of vector u, which are negative 1 and 4. All we do is we take 5 minus, well, negative 1. So I'm just subtracting uh, the first components. And then we'll take negative 3 uh, minus 4. And well, after we simplify, we'll get 5 minus negative 1. That's 5 plus 1. So we'll get our first component to be 6 negative 3 minus 4 will give us negative 7. So those would be the components of the vector w minus u. Um, okay, so part b, uh, kind of combining both ideas. So it says take 3 times vector w, which is 5, has components of 5 and negative 3, plus 2 times vector v, which are has components 0 and 2, minus 4 times vector u, which has components negative 1 and 4. Well, if we distribute the 3, we'll get 15 and negative 9 for our first, uh, the components of our first vector here, after multiplying. I'll distribute, you can fill, you know, it basically feels like distributing, so 2 times 0 will be uh, just still 0, 2 times 2 will give us 4, if you want to, you can imagine distributing the negative 4. So um, you could always think about this as being plus negative 4. So if we distribute that negative 4, negative 4 times negative 1 will be positive 4. Negative 4 times 4 will be negative 16. And now it's addition. Um, you could do these pairwise. You could do them two at a time if you want to. But the basic idea is if you have a bunch of addition, you just add all of the respective first components, so 15 plus 0 plus 4. And then our next component would just be negative 9 plus 4 plus, well, a negative 16. And let's see, I think we can clean this up without too much trouble. 15 plus 4 is going to give us 19. Negative uh, 9 plus 4 will be negative 5. Negative 5 plus negative 16 will be negative 21. And now we have the components of this new vector, uh, 3w plus 2v minus 4u.